As we know that, a number line is a line that has numbers at an equal interval. Let's learn to multiply integers using a number line. Two multiplied by five is basically two groups of five or five groups of two, which can also be understood as five jumps of two units or two jumps of five units on the number line. Therefore, to multiply integers two and five, jump two times five units or five times two units in the right direction starting from zero. The number we land on is the answer. Five multiplied by minus two is basically five groups of minus two, and two multiplied by minus five is two groups of minus five. To solve five into minus two, jump five times two units in the left direction starting from zero. The number we land on is the answer. Similarly, to solve two into minus five. Jump two times, five units in the left direction starting from zero. The number we land on is the answer. Therefore, two multiplied by minus five is equal to minus two multiplied by five. We will solve minus two into minus five in two steps. In step one, solve two into minus five, as we did earlier which results in minus 10. In step 2, to include one more minus sign, flip minus 10 to the other side of 0, which is the positive side. Hence answer is plus 10. Therefore, minus 2 multiplied by minus 5 is equal to 2 multiplied by 5. We can now conclude that, if the signs of integers are the same, the sign of the multiplication would be positive. And, if the signs of integers are different, the sign of the multiplication would be negative. What will happen if we multiply more than two negative signs? Let's multiply minus 2, minus 6 and minus 7. The multiplication of minus 7 and minus 6 is plus 42. If we multiply minus 2 into the result, the answer is minus 84. That concludes, if we multiply the negative integers 3 times, the answer is negative integer only. Similarly, we can show that, if we multiply negative integers 4 times, the answer is a positive integer. We can conclude that, if the number of negative integers is odd, then the product is a negative integer. And, if the number of negative integers is even, then the product is a positive integer.